And in my playbook tonight, Sarah Palin is running defense for Florida quarterback Tim Tebow. Tebow and his mother are starring in a pro-life Super Bowl ad sponsored by the conservative group Focus on the Family. CBS is airing it on Sunday despite a traditional policy of banning advocacy ads. Several women to scrap the Tebow ad, and that's where Sarah Palin comes in. She addresses these organizations in a Facebook post with some very strong language. For reaction to all of that, let's go to the president of the National Organization of Women, Terry O'Neill. Terry, great to have you with us tonight. Wouldn't your issue be more with, at this particular juncture, be more with CBS running the ad than anything Sarah Palin would say? What do you think? Well, sure. We were shocked when CBS, uh, when we learned that CBS was going to air a focus on the family ad. It's not just pro-life, it is anti-abortion rights for women. And uh, it went against CBS's policy. Uh, it seems a little hypocritical then for CBS when called out on that, that they changed their policy so that they could uh, then justify running the ad. It's highly controversial. It's not the right, uh, the Super Bowl is not the right place to be having that, uh, that ad air. What kind of response did you get from the network when you called them out on the uh, gay dating service ad that they wanted to run in the Super Bowl and that was rejected. Yeah, they haven't backed down on anything. Um, it, it's, uh, it's, it's a real shame. We are still hoping that CBS will pull that ad. Focus on the family is about as extreme as you can get. They have an agenda of overturning Roe versus Wade and uh, and their ad is, uh, is an ad that advances that agenda. It's so it's now going to run an ad in the Super Bowl? Why don't you run an ad in the Super Bowl? Why don't you counter it? I tell you what, if I had two, two and a half million dollars, I'd be putting it into achieving women's rights and not giving it over to CBS. I don't think that'd be a good use of my, my uh, members' money. Do you think it'll be effective for them? Uh, the ad, you know, I haven't seen the ad. I don't know what it is. I will tell you that when I first heard about it, uh, m one of my first thoughts was, wouldn't we celebrate that Pam Tebow had the ability to make that decision for her own health and make that decision for her family and for her own future? But don't we know that Focus on the Family would not want a woman in the same con in the same situation to make a different decision for herself yeah. and her family? President of now, Terry O'Neill, with us. Tonight. Thank you, Terry. Appreciate your time.